This video is in memory of Samuel Wade. Samuel lost his life not only because he was murdered, but also because of the neglect by MDOC, Mississippi State Penitentiary staff. Don't be fooled. What MDOC won't tell you is that Wade was housed with an inmate with psychiatric issues and had recently been housed at the state psychiatric facility, East Meridian Correctional. What they won't tell you is Wade was being housed in C custody due to a parole violation, which goes against MDOC policy. If MDOC would have classified Wade correctly, maybe he would still be alive. It's certain that he wouldn't have been housed with his murderer. What MDOC is not going to tell you is that a captain stood by and didn't immediately get help for Wade. And just as a side note, this captain has frequently sprayed inmates with mace when he's found contraband. Is the recovery of contraband more important than the life of a human being? It's obvious that to this particular captain, the lives of these inmates is of no importance. Because of MDOC's neglect, lives are being lost. In Samuel Wade's case, there were no attempts to save his life. To add to the neglect and disrespect, the staff clumsily dropped Wade's body down the stairs. How horrific, how disrespectful. It's time for MDOC to accept responsibility for their neglect and disrespect toward inmates and their families. It's time for people to stand up for what's right and speak out against the treatment of their loved ones in the facilities of MDOC. Inmates are dying at alarming rates in the Mississippi penal system. The proof has already been provided to you. Unsafe and unhealthy living conditions, unsupervised units in different buildings, unsafe food, contaminated water. These inmates are crying out for help. If you have an ounce of decency, any compassion within you, take a stand. Use your voice and demand an investigation on all of the facilities within the state of Mississippi.